Good morning, Southwest Florida. This Naples Herald Morning Report is sponsored by Conditioned Air, the comfort people since 1962. I'm Janelle Simmons. Today we have Governor Rick Scott making moves at GCU Women's Basketball and more. Today is March 18th and this is the Morning Report. While the Florida legislator struck down a proposed $1 billion worth of proposed tax cuts by Governor Rick Scott, by the time that the 2016 legislative session ended on Friday, the governor was still upbeat when visiting Fort Myers on Monday. Scott visited Fort Myers as part of a day-long multi-city swing his office called the Million Billion Jobs Victory Tour. The million came from State Department of Economic Opportunity estimates that the state has added over 1 million jobs since 2011, with the billion coming from $1 billion worth of tax cuts over the last two years. To learn more about Governor Rick Scott's tour, visit Naples Herald. Three points was all that separated the FGCU women's basketball team from hearing their name called during Monday night's NCAA tournament selection show. Still, the margin was enough for the 28-5 overall Eagles to crash land into the WNIT, making the transition from one tournament to another, being the conference tournament to the WNIT tournament. The Eagles will have to hone in on what lost them what looked to be an almost sure spot in the big dance. To learn more, visit Naples Herald. What began as a school project turned into Becker's entrepreneurial venture, a Naples-based golf club and real estate matchmaking business that simplifies the relocation process for snowbirds making the transition to the Sunshine State. This is how Golf Life Navigators was formed. To learn more about Becker and his journey to get to where he got today, visit Naples Herald. That was the Morning Report for today. I'm Janelle Simmons. The Morning Report airs Monday through Friday at 8 a.m. right here at NaplesHerald.com. And don't forget to check out our lunch break that also airs Monday through Friday at 12 p.m. Thank you for watching. Have a great weekend, and we'll see you Monday.